What's up, movie crew? Welcome to the latest Let's Watch. Before I get started, if you are new to this channel, my name is Luke, this is Let's Watch a Movie, and if you're in anything cinema and physical media related, you've come to the right place, so hit that subscribe button. Today, I am seeing past lives. All right, long story short, not really feeling some of the latest like big blockbuster movies. This is an A24 film. And this has been getting a lot of good reviews. So a lot of the people that I chat with personally on Instagram, we mainly talk horror films. This is not a horror film for anyone that's wondering. And this has probably been one of the most talked about movies with some of those people that I would like nine times out of 10 talk horror films with. So that should say something. But anyway, enough with that. I'm going to go in here, see past lives, and come back and give you my thoughts on the movie. All right, so I have just gotten out of seeing past lives. And overall, I like this one. I do want to give everyone the heads up because I don't really review a lot of foreign films and this isn't really a foreign film per se but because part of it does involve the main characters earlier childhood living in Korea there is a lot of subtitles so I don't know who all is okay with that and who all isn't but a lot of this movie is indeed subtitled so keep that in mind. But you've got two childhood friends slash first crush. The first time that you see them is right before one of them emigrates from Korea to America. Then you see them pick up 12 years later when social media is becoming more of a thing. And then present day. And present day you've got one who's now married you've got one who just got out of a relationship and it shows everything that led to where they are present day very good movie very well made definitely tugs on the heartstrings a couple of times but at the same time there's also a lot of feel-good moments So, A24, congrats. Once again, you y'all knocked this one out of the park. As far as cons go, the only real negative for me was there was a couple of times where it felt like they were probably going to go in a different direction and didn't. And while the movie itself still told a good story, kind of have that what if in the back of my mind, like, what if they did tweak something like right here, just do one little thing differently from what you would normally get? Not gonna lie, I thought about that a couple times. But overall, this is definitely a good movie. That's really the only con I have, and it's probably more of a nitpick than a con. You've got the main cast, which is really only three characters, or one actress and two actors throughout the entirety of the movie. You've got a couple of other people here and there, but for the most part, it's those three. And there's the idea of, well, in a past life, is this how things would be now? And it does leave you thinking in a couple of situations. And it also does show you Sometimes the person you meet back then and the person they are now aren't always the same person. And in some cases, that's a good thing because the roads that led to them to that where they are now is in many cases good. The ending was a very emotional thing, so gonna let everyone know now. 
this is a little bit emotional. And if you're a fan of dramas, if you're a fan of romance movies, definitely recommend checking this one out. And if you like A24, you definitely got to check it out because it's A24. Final score, I'm going to give this one a 4 out of 5. It was a great movie. It had really cool connections with everything. Like I said, my biggest issue was more of a nitpick than anything else. But that's going to do it for this one. If you are new to this channel, hit that subscribe button. You like what you see, leave a thumbs up. Comment down below. Is Past Lives still playing in your area? If so, what'd you think about it? If not, do you plan to pick this one up when it hits physical media? But that's going to do it for this one. Thank you all for watching and tune in next time.